Mzwa in a casing. Three casings plus the one in the bucket. They were connected in a series. The phones were the ones to receive the command from whoever would be having the controlling device, the remote control. And once set off, the explosives would go off in a series, wherever they, they would have been planted. Responding with urgency, law enforcement also apprehended landlords and tenants whose activities raised suspicion, a crucial step in preventing further threats. There are some people who brought some bombs and planted them in a certain room in our zone. And when we were informed, we had to alert the people around and then we moved them from their houses, put them in one place, and now we have taken them to the clinic a bit away from the place. But the security officers have been here and the situation is coming down. Informed yesterday night that the, around our, our area there is a house where there are bombs. So we managed to move around with the soldiers, the police, to look for that house. And eventually we happened to, to see the, where the, that house is and the technical guys identified that there are bombs there. The incident prompted immediate measures to ensure public safety with authorities evacuating the area surrounding the rental property. They found four improvised explosive devices and a number of ammunition as uh, you have seen. Regional intelligence and information gathered from those we arrested uh, already. They include Karanzi Augustine arrested in Masaka, Sulaiman Nsubuga arrested in Busia, Swale Abubakar arrested in Zambia, reveals that the terrorists are commanded by a one uh, he calls himself Punisher, alias in Subuga, Medi, alias in Kalubu. Action contributed to heightened tensions among local residents. <laughs> Brigadier General Felix Kulaije, speaking on behalf of the UPDF, commended the police response while urging continued vigilance among citizens. We have always told you, anybody unknown in your area, whoever comes, please report. The case is here. People came looking for a house to rent, and somebody gave them a house once she received the money. The problem in this country, you don't care to ask you who is, calling, who is asking for a house, where are you coming from? And so people saw individuals come with packages in the Vera and what, and they entered this house. He emphasized the shared responsibility of maintaining security within communities urging landlords to exercise diligence in screening potential tenants. The successful defuse of the bomb and subsequent arrests demonstrated the effectiveness of coordinated efforts in combating terrorism and ensuring public safety. Mike Bakablindi, for UBC. Yeah, for me.